News Today. Please subscribe to view the latest news. This is breaking news today. Today, what Trump said when Green Berets visited the White House will give you goosebumps. Upon February 26, President Trump told all those in presence at the governor's dinner in the White House that he plans to repair our exhausted military. This rebuilding consists of increases within shipbuilding, improvements of Army aircraft, as well as increases within our troops' capacity. Trump plans to also improve our protection spending through 10 percent to $54 billion. It's no real surprise that 60 percent our army personnel think Obama's reduces in army personnel, drawback of fight troops within Iraq as well as Afghanistan, together with his lack of concentration made America more dangerous. Trump's going to modify that. Big leak. Trump enjoys the Army and has demonstrated he has a brand new level of respect that our Army personnel never have seen in the past eight years. President Trump distributed some of that respect recently whenever a class of Green Berets candidates went to the White House. By Conservative Tribune 18 Army officials in the Special Forces Qualification Course, or maybe Q Course had been visiting the National Security Council when Sebastian Gorka recommended they meet up with the president. Halfway through the conversation, Trump, stated, Hey, we're not really supposed to do this but come with me, and he introduced them all into the Oval Office, took a photograph round the Resolute table, and then, throwing the actual schedules right into a bit of a tizzy, said, OK, that's inadequate, Sebastian Gorka described. Given all the photos associated with Trump's encounter with people within the Oval Office that have emerged over the past 30 days, this may not really seem like an enormous deal, however in fact it really is. This was the very first time in the Green Berets course's history in which candidates visited the Oval Office. Nothing like this came near to happening below President Barack Obama. He said, stand within the corner. They all stood in the spot, and one by one took pictures they can take for them to their family members with every future Green Berets alongside the leader at the Oval Office table, Gorka explained. President Trump showed respect to Green Berets like no other president. While visiting the White House he broke protocol, and invited the soldiers in the Oval Office to take pictures, Sebastian Gorka confirms. Why is this tale even more incredible was the undeniable fact that Trump held this February 7 conference private. Absolutely no photos happened to be released, and the Trump-hating media pool did not report into it, even though it had been announced a daytime before this occurred. Trump could have used opportunity for a publicity rating, but instead he chose to keep this as a private event. That's one hallmark of any real chief. That's just how much he really likes our troops our own warriors," he stated. Gorka had previously mentioned the conference during feedback at the 2017 Conservative Political Action meeting on Friday under Obama, they won't even see the West Wing. This isn't Obama's America anymore. With President Trump within the White House, America will discover, not only will certainly our army be improved, but the well-being of our soldiers will be enhanced. It's the perfect time to make America great again. And that consists of making our army the best on the planet. Thank you, Mr. President about treating a few of America's finest dot like they deserve. God bless our army.